So today, March 29th, I have finished grabbing the edge of the table, the mirrored edge. So, and uh, I've uh, cleaned it with clear water so that I can now let it rest for five days before sealing. So this is, this is uh, almost the end. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I'm here. Very excited. So I'll come back. I'll seal the table next Thursday because I have a meeting on Wednesday. And uh, three coats of sealer. And this baby is finished. This mosaic is 16 feet long and 5 feet wide. I laid the first tile, after preparing the table, I laid the first tile on January 6th. And here we are, March 29th. So, there were some snow days in there. We had, this was a very snowy winter, so, and I did this all on site, so. <sighs> So, uh, I'm very excited. I think it came out really well. Uh, the project supervisors uh, at the recycling center where I am, in Yonkers, they are very pleased with how the table came out. And I can just imagine all of the county execs sitting around this conference table and having meetings and talking about recycling. And uh, so, it's and I can just imagine how lovely it will make everyone look <laughs> to be sitting around a table like this and having meetings and talking about very important things. And oh, it's just exciting, so exciting to know that people are going to use this table, that it's going to have a function, and uh, it's beautiful to look at, but it is actually serving a function, and it has resonance because. You know, it's talking about recycling. And uh, I was here the other day when some kids came through. And uh, one little girl, she was a Girl Scout, she says, I want to do this. So I said, go home and uh, ask your parents if you can upcycle your bed, you know, your nightstand. Or a chest of drawers. So... I, I'm very, very pleased to know that kids are going to come in here and they're going to be inspired to, uh, and to know that recycling can be a fun and beautiful thing to do. So anyway, I will chat soon. Thanks for checking me out. Bye.